The Florida Department of Transportation plans to establish the nation's first test bed for air taxis at the SunTrax facility in Auburndale. As soon as those vehicles are approved, Florida, we hope and intend, Florida will be the first place that they start flying and it will and can have an impact on I-4 if they're successful. Which may be music to the ears of anyone who has ever dealt with I-4 traffic. So the plan, two vertiports where these vehicles can take off straight up and carry passengers airborne in short hops. They kind of look like, uh, uh, like almost like a helicopter, but they don't have the propeller. They just kind of have like little small wings and they just go straight up and then kind of take you. They run on battery power. The vertiports are battery powered and designed to go about 60 miles and carry up to six people, including the pilot. So it'd be more of like a um, probably like an air version of like an Uber going to and play places. But the idea would be if they can do this to scale, if they can make it economical, um, it would take some traffic off the roads.